Now to an update. It has been about a month now since Montgomery County Public Schools put a new safety plan in place following the Gaithersburg versus Northwest football fight. Well, another rivalry is coming up tomorrow night and MCPS is trying to get ahead of another incident occurring. Our Cheyenne Corinne spoke with the Bethesda Chevy Chase High School community whose senior night game time was changed due to safety concerns. So it's called senior night, but this year the football game will be a little earlier due to safety concerns. Bethesda, Chevy Chase and Walt Whitman High Schools have a long standing rivalry that school officials say in the past resulted in violence, but not everyone agrees that by changing game time, especially on senior night will solve this problem. Senior night is something that I think myself and all my fellow seniors have been looking forward to for as long as I can remember. BCC senior night was scheduled for 630 Friday, but was moved to 5 p.m. The principal says their decision was made in collaboration with Montgomery County Police and aligns with the new athletic safety plan. You know, it's a handful of hooligans that need to be controlled. Yes, but canceling a game is like putting a bandaid on a broken arm. BCC's principal changed the time to 4 p.m. earlier this week, but after receiving emails from parents and a petition with almost 500 signatures, the school scheduled it an hour later. In a letter to the school community, the principal wrote, the rivalry between these two schools has resulted in increased civil and criminal disruptions in downtown Bethesda. We reached out to the school district for concrete examples that led to their decision, but did not hear back. If it's stuff going on outside of uh, of the game you know nothing happened at BCC and these kids didn't do anything to deserve to lose their senior night and this isn't the first time BCC has been impacted by the Gaithersburg Northwest fight the team also missed their homecoming game because their opponents had to forfeit the game as a consequence of the brawl it wasn't our fault and it just you know it feels like we're getting punished for something that's out of our control even more the president of BCC Sports Booster says with any conflict, the way to resolve it is to build relationships. Community events that involved other schools, team building, you know, with other schools to, you know, so students know each other and they're not going to be confront, you know, fighting with each other if they know somebody from another school. Reporting in Montgomery County, Maryland, I'm Cheyenne Coren for DC News Now.